everyone, and welcome back to another building tutorial, where today we're doing coonskin dump. So let's get to building. Here are all the materials you're going to need. Please make sure you have access to all these materials and enough. Sorry. You want to you wanna grab smooth stone, iron bars, stone bricks, smooth stone slabs, dark oak fence gates, coarse dirt, dark oak signs, stone brick stairs, stone brick slabs, Ladders, black concrete, yellow concrete, green concrete, spruce trap doors, dark prismarine stairs, polished po polish black stones, brick stairs, chains, stone brick walls, polished andesite stairs, minecart, minecart, rails, levers, mangrove buttons, warp buttons, blue concrete, warp stairs, warped doors, smooth quartz slabs, Birch slabs, oak slabs, spruce slabs, jungle slabs, and dark oak slabs. And then we'll come back and get the rest of the materials later. So you first want to go to this area where it doesn't bump into any other builds that you have done. And you want to dig out one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then you want to place in eight blocks and then place iron eight iron bars on and eight iron bars on the bottom and seven on top so you go one two three four five six seven so it makes eight in total and then you want to add another row of iron bars And you want to do the same thing. You want to add a layer of two iron bars. Like this. You also want to... Dang it. You want to build up... No. to the top where your other iron bar pillar is. Do not do this. Okay. And then you want to add another layer of iron bars like this. And then add another layer on the bottom of iron bars. Just like this. And then you want to go into the center and place iron bars until you have a two by two space. Sorry guys if I'm taking too long. There's this new feature in Minecraft where it just delays your uh, break speed. I don't know what's going on. So you, do. so basically you want to do two on each side. Then you want to fill the center with stone brick, just like that. And then you want to build stone brick all the way up, just like that. And then you want to repeat this process three times, or at least another two times. So you want to break out eight blocks again. Place another layer of iron bars, another layer of iron bars, and another layer of iron bars. And then you want to go to the top and place another layer of iron bars. And then you want to connect them down just like this. Connect them down again like this. And then connect another pillar down 
like that. And then you fill it in with some brick. <laughs> and once you're done, you place the pillar just like this out of stone brick. And repeat this process once again. So then you can put stone brick like this again. So I won't cover much detail, but basically you want to do this same process about three times. So one, two, three. You then want to place another layer of three on the top. Once again, connect these like that, and then keep connecting it all the way down. place it once again in the center. Four stone bricks in the center. And then place a pillar, a stone brick all the way up. And place two pillars behind it just like this. Place another two on the other side just like that. Break out another eight blocks. Place a stone brick. Break out another eight blocks. Place more stone brick. I mean smooth stone, just like this. And then, you grab more iron bars. like this you can then build up another pillar just like that place iron bars on the side of the wall pillar and drag it all the way across Something like this. And fill the center once again with stone brick. And you want to repeat the same process on this side, so do something like this. Place more pillars going all the way up like that. You then want to place a layer underneath once again, and another layer once again underneath. Place another, nope, not like that. Actually, you can leave these two, but do not fill the center because we want to 
place in some stone brick for intricate details. So add more on this side. And then you can then put something, you can then put stone brick in the center. And then once again, place a triangular pillar just like this. There you go. And then on this side, you repeat the same process. And there you go. That is the back wall or the side walls done. And now for this one, it's actually you don't build the middle. You actually want to leave it. So you want to dig out another four blocks once again, and on this side as well, dig out another four. And I'm pretty sure. Yep. You then want to also place stone brick on here. And you want to put it all the way to the top. And once again. And then, just like the side and the front, you fill it with iron bars except for the middle.
And then you do it on this side. Why can't I fly? There we go. What is going? I don't know what's going on, guys. This new feature is kind of really annoying for some reason. And you're done. That is the entire fence complete. And then you want to place smooth stone across the entire fence. And there you go. And then for the middle over here, you're going to break out a bunch of blocks. Replace it with coarse dirt. And place dark oak fences on top of it. And then you want to dig out the entire floor within the boundaries of the dump. Now, you can also use world edit, so you can do something like this. You do a slash fill, negative 35, or whatever coordinates you're using. There you go. And then you want to fill Now for you can actually get rid of your poor dirt now you don't you no longer need it. So over here you skip three blocks so you go one, two, three, and then place a stone brick. You place five stone brick on top of each other. Nope, you actually place four, never mind. (laughs) 
You then want to place a block behind here and place this upside down stair. Just like that. Place two stone bricks in front. Okay. So you then place another block behind it. Place another upside down stair. Place more upside down stairs behind there. You want to build up four blocks behind. You can then break the blocks behind it. And then fill it in with slabs. And there you go. So now once you, oh wait, no. You then want to place stone brick across to make a floor just like that. Grab your yellow and black concrete. You want to place three in the middle and going across. You then want to place yellow concrete on the sides and then place black concrete, just like this. Oh, yeah. And you also want to place a ladder behind it as well. Just like that. You can then fill in the center blocks with stone brick. Fill in the sides with stone brick. And then do this. You can put, put it behind. Put it in front as well. And then. Okay. You can then fill it in just like this. And place ladders. Just like that. You then add a layer of green and black concrete. Just like this, and then you do black. And then place ladders just like this. You then add a rim of stone brick, just like this. You then want to place iron bars, like this. And then you place black concrete, just like this. You place green concrete, just like that, you add another rim, green concrete, just like that, You can then grab some dark prismarine just like this. You can add dark prismarine on each side. Sides like this. And just like that. And 
and you want to fill in the rest with green concrete. Just like that. And in front of this green concrete, you place upside down prismarine stairs. Just like that. You can then add a black concrete, just like this. Polished black stone stairs like that. You can add iron bar like this. Add a spruce trap door on the side of it. You can then add a stone brick stair and a pole and dark prismarine stairs. Oh, dang it. And stairs like that. You can then add, I'm pretty sure, you can add green and stone brick stairs. Why do I keep pressing that? And then just like that. You add a stair in front of it. Why am I... You add a stair in front of it. You then grab your green concrete once again and place it like that. And then on top, once again, you place more green concrete. Then want to add an extra five. One, two, three, four, five. Add another extra five on this side and cap it off just like this. You can then grab some stone brick just like this. And then add. Stone brick on top, you can add stone brick just like this. I'm pretty sure add an iron bar. Okay, no, you add a chain. So instead you add an iron bar on top just like this. And you basically want to connect it. Just like this. And then underneath, you place a chain. You can then add a stone brick, just like this. And slabs like that then place upside down stairs just like this and add walls underneath and that gives you your claw So you, you then want to place a layer of blue concrete. You want to place about 13. 13 blocks of blue concrete. You then want to add another six blocks. And 
and then add another six blocks. Just like that. And then you want to connect it and fill in the floor. You want to fill in the floor even more. Then one, two, I need to check again. I am so stupid. Okay. I'm pretty sure... You want to add another layer, just like that. Make a bit of an alcove pattern. Like this, I'm pretty sure. Or is it the center bit? There you go. And on this, oh, come on. on this side, you add something like this. And then you just want to fill in the wall just like this. You go and then you place doors underneath the stairs. Just like that. And then, oh wait, no. You're supposed to add something like this. And add warp stairs like that. Then you add a layer on top. So basically all the blue concrete that you placed above the first layer, you want to build it all the way to the top. Then want to cap it off. And then you want to grab your ladders and place it all the way on top. You then also want to place A bunch of blue concrete on the alcoves like that. Nope, 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 nope. And then you want to grab out these slabs. Just like this. I'll keep doing that. And then you want to place, nope, not like that. You want to place it like this. Now, this, if this triggers you, I, I'm very sorry. But this is apparently what the planks look like. Now, inside, you want to add some light by adding lanterns. I'm pretty sure we used pretty much all the materials. Oh yeah, also, in here, you want to add a rail. I'll keep pressing that. Break, break at least two blocks. And then grab your minecart. And then go underneath and break 
Nope, do not sit in the minecart. You can then break the nut. There you go. Then replace the blocks once again. Stop. Do not click the question mark. Oh, right, you're supposed to grab it. So this version has been updated, so you can go back and redo the, I guess, uh, Robot Repair Tech factory colors on the exterior walls. Grab your pistons. And then get rid of your minecart and rails. Yeah, and your ladders, because I don't think you're going to need them. You can then get rid of your chains, your concrete. Grab a piston and a block and any source of redstone you want. Grab your trapdoors once again and place them around the chair just like that. Grab a lever and place it like this. And you add a warp button and a mango button just like this. You can get rid of it afterwards. Your fence gates, you can get rid of that. And you can also add a sign that says keep out. And on this side, you want to write keep, and then underneath, out. There you go. You can get rid of your signs and your warp blocks, your prismarine blocks, your slabs, just like this, your spruce slab, your blue concrete, your other concrete as well. You can also get rid of your smooth stone, I'm pretty sure. Now you move into the interior design. You do not need these trappers because you already have them. You want to grab flower pots, item frames, weighted pressure plates, trip hook, trip wire hooks, levers, paintings, armor stands, the goat horn, the seek version, because I feel like it sounds more like an alarm, but you can do any version you want. A water bottle, potion of fire resistance, milk, bread, cooked chicken, lanterns, chests, and oak signs. You can then swap those items out, just like that. Me grab your spruce stairs because I'm an idiot. place a chest and then let it say you want to first add some equal signs and you let it say emergency supplies and add more equal signs Just like that. Nope, do not add another sign. So then you want to add some lanterns in front over here. You can then add a shelf. You can add a cake. Add some item frames. Grab these materials. So you want to add a steak or cooked beef, and then you can then rotate it sideways. For the water bottles, you can rotate it upwards. 
and the portion of fire resistance, then you don't need these anymore. And afterwards, you grab more spruce slabs and you grab more item frames. I forgot this. I need you still need your water bottle, which I idiotically threw out. You can add a water bottle like this, get rid of it, get milk, bread, and chicken. You can put milk over there, your bread like this, and your chicken like that. There you go. You can then grab your goat. You can grab an armor stand and put it in this pose. And for this one, you want to put it in this pose. Grab two goat horns and place them in there. And then name it. Because there's a lot of armor stands in this world, and I can't just make all of them go invisible. But basically, you want to add a name tag, and, you want, and make it say Megaphone. Just like that. And also like this. And then, you can get rid of those. And then you want to type in slash effect. E name equals mega phone invisibility and the amount of time you want and you want to write true so it looks actually invisible and there you go you got floating goat horns you can then get rid of your lanterns your chests Grab your spruce stairs, grab your smooth stone stuff, paintings, and other supplies you can get. Do not do that. So basically, you want to add smooth slab like this, and smooth slab, and then fences in the middle. You can then Place an item frame, and you want the spider painting. Yes, you want this painting. Then you can add any source of painting you want, just like this, or that, yep, that. Yep, the painting like this, and for this one, like that, and you can actually change this painting because you don't need it. Yeah, you want all these four paintings, because they look like conspiracy boards, painting, because so, they look like she's on a conspiracy thought. You can add item frames, except for, you can add two item frames. You can add a weighted pressure plate. You can add, oh my god, stop. You can add flower pots, a tripwire hook, and a lever, and rotate them, just like this. So this kind of looks like a magnifying glass, and this looks like one of those pointer hands. And then you can get rid of all these. Do not do that. So also get rid of all your materials that you do not need, except for these, because they're actually going to be important later on. And then grab all these blocks. You want to grab raw blocks of copper, iron, honey, honeycomb, slime blocks, hay bales, gray wool, barrels, dried kelp, sea pickles, iron block, campfire, any sort of shovel, and a stone button. So, 
on this side. You add a rock copper. Because I don't know why, because it looks like expired food to me. Or like raw beans. I felt like that would work. And same with the iron block. There you go. And you do the same thing for this side. And then over here you want to add honey. Just like that. And you can do the same thing with hay bales on this side. Just like that. You can then get some honeycomb. layer it like this and then you can grab slime blocks and put it in the corner over here so it's actually much bigger than that just like that now for the barrels oh no you want to place them vertically. Just like this. You then want to crouch and place them on top of each other. Just like this. And then, I think you're supposed to re you can grab that. I also forgot to do this, sorry guys. You can put iron bars like this. You can then get rid of these blocks. Grab stone bricks. You can then put something like this. And there you go. And you can officially get rid of these blocks. And if you want to grab gray wool. You can get rid of your barrels. Grab some sea pickles. Grab your iron block, campfire, some buttons, and a shovel. You can then place a layer of gray wool, just like this. You can then place dried kelp, because it looks a lot like garbage grass. Got the idea from Pearlescent Moon, shout out to her. And then on top you can add sea pickles. So then you can get rid of these. Not do that. You can go over here, you can place iron blocks just like this, you can then get rid of this, get rid of that, basically you want to fill an outer layer just like this, break the center block and build up these just like that, and then underneath you want to add iron bars just like this so that she can rotate it and pull it up. And then you can officially get rid of these. And for the campfires, you can just layer them like this. Put it out. You can do it at the back as well. Oh, 
also over here you can add campfires just like this. You can add campfires here. You can add campfires just over here. Campfires across over here. And then over here you can place another row of campfires. And over here as well you can add a campfire. And over here you can add a campfire. Over here you can add a campfire. Over here you can also add a campfire. Just like this. And then you can get rid of these. And now we move on to the sign. Ooh. So you can grab these blocks, grab spruce trap doors as well. You don't need this chest. And then we'll do the banner for last. You also need a brown banner. Just like this. You then want to skip a block and place 12 blocks. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Do not place that there. You then want to do, repeat the same thing on the other side. You can then place a layer of white concrete okay and then you add another two more layers just like that and then add an outer layer of white concrete like this and then you add spruce trap doors and then you can flick all the trap doors And then get rid of them. And now we move on to the banners. So first, you want to grab just one banner. Please, thank you. And you want to make the letter C. So you basically want to add some brown on top, brown on the bottom, brown on the sides, and then add a white border. And then you can add another. You can brown on each side and on top and bottom and on the right layer. Now for for the N you wanna put a brown pale dexter, a brown bend, and a brown pale sinister. And then add a border just like this. Now for S You want to add a brown chief fess, a brown face fess, a brown, a brown bend, a brown, bo a white border indented, and then a white border. Then we got K. You can add a brown per tail, a brown bend, and a brown. Ben Sinster. You can then add a border like this. For I, you can then place a strip in the middle and place squares on top. You can then add a border just like this. And now for the 
You can then grab a brown banner. You can put some teeth just like this and add a center. And then add a dot in the middle. Add a brown stripe like this and a white like this. That's good. Now you got your D. You can then add a brown pale Dexter, a brown pale Sinster, a brown base Fess, and a white border. For M, you want to place something like this. You want to add like a bit of teeth. You can then a border and then this now you've got M and now for P you can add something like this you can then add you can you want to cover it you want to place a fess you want to cover the sides and even the top and then the border then for this one Basically, just it's really simple. You the bottom and the top, and over here you add C. You want to spell coon, and then skin, and in the middle you add dump. D U M P, and the rest you just add a raccoon tail. And there you go. That is the entire build video complete. Nice. Uh, you also want to add glow ink on everything, which I'm going to do now. So yeah, I forgot to add glow ink. So basically you want to add something like this, white dye. And over here, you want to color the sign, not like that, like this. There you go. Now that's the end of the video. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Please make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you get notified every time I make a new video. And please help me get to 10 million. I'm proving my parents that this is an actual job. So I'll see you later. Bye!